All right, so this tutorial is going to cover installing Rubies on the, in the SketchUp interface here. Uh, so there's two ways I'm going to show you guys how to do this. Uh, the first is to go through the system preferences within the software and install them there. Or, and the second is to go through the actual Windows interface and um, moving files across. So the first way we go and do that is by uh, under the Window tab, we scroll down under Preferences. Uh, and then you're going to come up with a bunch of different system preferences in here. You're going to see a toolbar, or some, one of the items here is extensions. And uh, we want to go ahead and install an extension. And from there it gives us a window pull-up here for us to go through and um, find the, the RBZ file um, that you guys have uh, downloaded from uh, anywhere, any one of a number of resources that uh, SketchUp supplies here. So we can go ahead and we can select that, and then we can go ahead and open that up. And it, it's going to basically warn you, do you trust this extension uh, to access your file systems? Uh, for the most part, as long as everything's vetted and you've done a little bit of research on it, um, you can hit yes. And we can go ahead and hit OK. All right. We hit OK. And then we go plugins. And you can see that this is popped up here. Uh, simple loft. And it's, if we look here, you can actually see that it's ready to go now. OK. Uh, now, the second way to do this, uh, and this is I have two different options here is to actually go into the uh, documents and settings on your computer here and if we go into the C drive program files we should have a and even though uh, SketchUp is owned by Tribble now uh, it's under the Google tab here and we should be able to Google SketchUp 8 and under plugins, uh, we should have other extensions. Now you can see here that Simple Loft is actually listed here now. Um, some of the downloads I found, um, you can see is here is an RBZ file, and you have to install that uh, the long way. Um, and that has some, uh, obviously, some different conditions in here. I've also downloaded uh, the un an unfolding tool in here. Um, and so if you have an RB file extension, you have to do this a long way. I've found it tends to error out and not recognize the file. So uh, I would recommend using this system uh, as the most common way of doing this. So you just take that, and you can take and drag, and it'll copy into the plugins. And uh, I already have this installed here, so we'll go ahead and cancel out of that. But uh, and you can see it's over here. And then when we pull up SketchUp, we should be able to get the plugins uh, once you reboot. So. All right, and that's installing plugins from the, or, or sorry, Ruby scripts.